Yo, welcome back, Zykor here, along with Trizen. And today in Ark, well, it's the excellent adventure uh, event, I guess. And we thought we'd come back and try to do that here, uh, collecting a bunch of dodo eggs and, you know, I guess making some of the skins and I don't know. I'm not sure if we'll get all the skins made. Sometimes it takes a lot of dodo egg collecting, but the dodo eggs are easier to collect than in some of the other events so that's good so um yeah i guess we'll see what we can collect here and yeah um now uh we did a dino wipe here so that giga from the last episode isn't over there anymore at least i don't think so you never know it could have respawned but um yeah i and actually i had um, just died a bunch of times trying to drag it over that way <laughs> uh, But yeah, that's what you have to do with a giga now, isn't it? So uh, yeah, there isn't any dodos in our vicinity here probably because we haven't really left but I think uh, Trizen had found some dodos over in this direction So I'm gonna head over here and see if I can collect some dodo eggs I think I might have seen some maybe way over there too, but you know in the distance So let's see get over here without running into anything that will eat me and there's a dillo hey a nice colored dillo what what level is this dillo a 140 dillo actually I want that no run run <laughs> uh, okay uh, let's see I actually would like to tame those dillos because one is a 140 and it's green but uh, I'd have to use my club wait can you use a club on a dillo that's actually a that's yeah definitely something I'd want to do um, let's see the green one there is the is the one I'd want to do oh there's three dillos Nuts. Um, let's see. This one is the one I'd go after. I don't know what the level of the others are. Yeah. Come on. No! You gotta make sure you dodge that. Just keep... Yeah, keep swinging. <laughs> no! No, my club broke. I don't have the materials to <laughs> to repair it. Uh, okay, what do I need? Uh, I don't know what I need. Let's see. Hold that. I need fiber and wood. Great. Um, X. Oh, I could have probably picked up some wood on the beach. He's still following me. Stop following me. I want to tame you anyway. There we go. Uh, repair that. There we go. Keep going to the side. Oh, how did you hit me? Just keep swinging. Is he going to go down? Like I killed that Dillo in the last episode. Stop damaging me. You're going to make me have to heal myself. Make sure you, yeah, dodge. I'm gonna end up dead. How long does it take to knock out a Dillo <laughs> with a club? Okay, he's running, so that's good. No, I don't want to get him to the water. Come on, keep, keep beating him with a club. No, <laughs> he's going into the water. Gotta get to my club. I don't want to use my hatchet on it. Where'd he go? Oh, there we go. Oh, yes. Okay, um, now we just need some meat, which our dodo should have. That's nice. We <laughs> we clubbed a dillo to, <laughs> to unconsciousness. Uh, and I'm nearly unconscious myself. Okay. I'm gonna go back here grab some food for the dillo uh, hopefully uh, 
I think Trizen got rid of the other two Dillos. But that's a nice green Dillo. I like that one. And it was 140. Actually, it's very rare in Arc to run into a high level, nice colored animal. So that's actually a rarity. So I'm going to head over here, get. Oh, uh, what? I mean, it's unfortunate. It's, it's a high level, but we only have like regular meat. We don't have. We don't have like prime or anything like that. But at least we have narco berries. I'll get. I'll. I'll take some just in case Trizen doesn't gather enough. Uh, of course, I need some berries myself because I am nearly dead. Just eat that. Actually, you know, I'm gonna keep those on me because. Yeah. Okay, just keep going. Run over here. Trizen probably had some food on him, so he's probably started the taming process. Just get over here. At least I think it was over here. Yeah, over by these trees. And I'm going to be out of stamina. Okay, here we go. Hello, Dillo. Um, I gotta make sure I don't punch it. Oh, almost, almost tamed already. Okay, well, that's nice. Uh, I won't even need narcotics. Or narco berries. Um, okay. Well, there we go. Um, well, yeah. Uh, what should we name it, though? Hmm. It is a male. Um. I don't know what we have named for other Dillos. So, maybe we'll have to decide on that later, but... We'll see. Okay, um, you can be the little guard dog for now. So I'm taking him over here to the dodos. And it was, I think he should have enough food. Let's see. Oh, you know, he's my refrigerator. Uh, put all this on it. There we go. And actually, I'll take half of these for myself. Okay. Oh, a bunch of dodo eggs. Actually, this is good. Yeah, this is nice. Just gather all of these dodo eggs. Best thing to do, hit F to gather all of them. Yeah, if you notice, the dodo eggs are everywhere, and this is just from one dodo. So it's actually pretty easy to gather them. It's just it takes a quite a while to gather up enough to create the stuff, the skins and stuff in the cooking pot. And you can also, I mean, it's possible you can maybe, you know, like, grab them with a grappling hook and pull them into, a, like, a pen or something. But I don't think they're, like, pick upable with a dino or, a like, a pteranodon or anything. I don't think you can pick them up with that. I think they intentionally did that to prevent people from making a huge uh, dodo egg farm. But, um, let's see, just from this dodo here alone here, already I've gotten 20 of them, so, yeah, it's actually quite a bit, quite often that they drop them, so it's pretty good. But I guess, since it's nighttime, I'm gonna keep gathering eggs from this dodo, and probably poot to boot, <laughs> and I guess bring you back when we've got a bunch of them. I also have to make a cooking pot to make some of the skins, too, so... Yeah. It's ironic that the one dodo that is max level is a dodo I can't tame. Yeah. Crazy. Would you stop? I, I tell you. Pteranodons these days. Okay, um, yeah, I guess I am overweight with dodo eggs. I've gathered a bunch of them. So I'm going to get back to base here and make a cooking pot quick to see how many we actually need. Finally back at base. And there's a trike here who is somehow scaling this rock. I don't know how he's doing that, but yeah, he was a, he was up on top of there. Yeah, he's a really good climber, apparently. Okay, so let's see here. We've got 
a bunch of eggs that we've gathered here. So what? This is like like 500 or no 440 of them. So it's not bad. I'll give this poop to the dillo because we'll need that. Because yeah, Trizen created a couple of crop plots out here. We've got some long grass seeds. We we're going to start uh, planting and stuff, but we got to wait for it to rain. At least for now. I could just put up some uh, some irrigation, but eh, we'll wait for it to rain for now. So we'll need the the poop to yeah fertilize. Okay, now let's see. I need to make a crop. Uh, not a crop plot. Yeah, I'm going to make another crop plot just because. <laughs> No, I need to make a a cooking pot. And not like an S plus cooking pot or anything, just a regular cooking plot and pot. Where I can't remember where cooking pot is. Been a long time. I think that's isn't it like level nine? Or eight. I know oh there. S plus okay, there we go. It's level eight. It takes nine Ingram points, that's what. Okay, got a regular cooking pot. Let's see what I need for it, if I can get in the door. Hello, Dillo. Now, uh, oh, wrong box. Wait, we don't have one, do we? No, we got a pestle. That's not bad. We need to put down a forge, too. Um, let's see. So, uh, redwood tree wood. Hmm, can't remember where we got that from. Okay, so what do I need for it here? Uh, flint, stone, thatch, wood. So, flint, stone, thatch, and wood. Okay, good. And yeah, like I said, you can't use any modded cooking pots because generally somebody, the modders don't usually make a cooking pot that supports the event items. Generally, it's only the vanilla cooking pot that supports those so yeah that's why you got to make them or make that otherwise an s plus one would be better to make but okay i'll just place it back out here and let's see yeah it's probably better to put it close to the water here so right in the corner here right by the rock because then it's safe at least that's the thought is it really safe? You never know. Okay, let's see what it takes. Uh, holiday. Okay, so this takes 35. That's the C4 skin. Well, I would use the C4 skin. Um, <laughs> we don't have access to C4 right now. Okay, that takes 40. That's a hat. The spear takes 35. The bunny hop emote takes 50. And then bunny ears, which I'd like, 25. And this is the dino skin 25 so 40 and then 40 okay so most things take 40 the suit takes a hundred that's a lot and bunny tail skin what is that you can use the skin I mean, to skin the appearance of pants and gain a fluffy tail it's a hundred percent cotton tail okay well I'll have to make that it's a pants skin hmm interesting haven't seen that before. And then a tail wiggle emote, that's 50. The chocolate rabbit club, I have to have that just to put on my club. And the dino marshmallow hat and the regular marshmallow hat. Okay, so technically I probably need, I, I don't know how many that this is, probably a couple, a few hundred. <laughs> so probably need like 600 or so of them just to be safe on the safe side, but... I mean, quick calculation, no, never mind. I'm not, I'm not an ideal one to do quick calculations. But I mean, just looking at these two, 100 alone, 100, uh, 50. So yeah, that, that easily right here is just 250. And then these, this is 40, 40, 40, 40. That's another, you know, like over I mean, almost like 160 right there. And so, yeah, that would be over 400 already just with those things. 
So yeah, probably five or six hundred. Which, we've got 400, so technically I guess I should make some here. Um, let's see. Transfer some in. Let's get... Uh, nope. I can only take... I can't even take one stack. Uh, let's put that in at 50. Yeah, I have to transfer them small stacks at a time. Frankly, we should probably just start putting them in the cooking pot. And I also should take... I don't really want to burn wood in there, but I guess it's not that big of a deal. There we go. Let's take a stack of wood. There we go. Keep bringing more. Make more and more. If anybody knows where that term is from, put that in the comment section. Okay. Just keep adding. This is the. Yeah. <laughs> this is tedious. Okay, um, I've got 200 in there. I'm not gonna really count the one. Okay, well, you know, we've got a good 500. So we'll see what we can make with all 500. If I can just get them in there quick enough. I mean, yeah, I have the S plus transfer gun. I would like to use that, but actually that probably wouldn't work. I'd transfer everything in this box in there and that wouldn't work, but. I mean, yeah, I guess I could use the pull feature. Maybe I should just do that. I'm, it's been a while. Uh, let's see. Let's see if those, if these eggs are even in the pull feature. Uh, right here, I think. Is it bunny? No, they're probably not in there. Nope. Bunny eggs are not in here. So, yeah. Manual all the way. We should have added a door to this side of the house. Would have been better. Eh. When you get stuck on the door, then... Because doors like to grief you. Run in here. Oh, there was a nice uh, blue-colored dillo that I saw over there, too, that I'd be interested in taming. But what would I do to tame a dillo? Well, I'd club another one. Using a chocolate bunny club, because why not? Who wouldn't use a chocolate bunny to tame a dillo? Okay, this should be uh, two more trips. Yeah, two more. Uh, Trizen will probably help a little bit. Uh, no, I, don't, I can take all of them. There we go. Okay. Um, you know, Trizen can transfer the rest. Let's see here. Now, if I boot this up, yes, I'm going to boot a cooking pot. Light the fire. There we go. Okay, let's see. I want to. I want to make the chocolate rabbit club. I'll just make two of those. One. I mean, one for both me and Try. Because why not? There we go. And then I would like to make the emotes first, because then we have those and can use them. So yeah, I'm gonna make. I guess two for Trizen and me as well. I guess that's quite a bit. We can maybe make some more of this stuff for Trizen later. Uh, and the bunny tail. I want to actually see that. So I'll make two of them. There we go. These hats, uh, I'm sure pretty much everyone has seen before. So really, those aren't too important. The, uh, the bunny costume, I'll probably make that, but <laughs> I think it's ugly. Uh, <laughs> but we'll see. We'll, we'll check it out. Um... And I did like this Easter egg hat, so I will make one of those, at least. And then, of course, the bunny ears, because why not on those? The dino bunny ears, we'd only be able to put those on the Dillo. No, I can't make anything else. Um, let's see. I'll take one of these out for me. Uh, Trizen needs to take his stuff. 
Now, we don't have a lot left in here. I'll make one bunny costume. Because I probably won't be wearing it too much. That used a lot of eggs, but we'll see. I can try it on. And then I'll take one of these each. Anything else here? I mean, yeah, I'll, I can maybe make some of this stuff later, but I don't need to make it right now. And this uh, is a Procopedon bunny costume. I We don't have a Procopedon right now, so we probably can't make that anyway. Okay, I'll leave that there. Actually, I can tr take this out. Made that. There we go. Okay, let's get over here into the light. Is that? Oh, that's a very blue overraptor over there. I don't have my spyglass. I don't even know. Did I make myself a spyglass? I might not have. Yeah, that's kind of a cool overraptor. I don't know what level it is, but it looks like it's running away from us. Okay. Now, now that I'm over here, uh, let's see. What do I have in my inventory? So, the bunny tail, I'll have to put that on in my pants. Let's see. Put it on my pants. There we go. Uh, does it show? <laughs> eh, that's funny. Uh, I'll have to look at that outside here. Uh, let's consume these. This is the tail wiggle emote and the bunny hop dance emote. Okay, there we go. And I'll put this on my club. Now I can beat things with a chocolate bar. And, you know, I'll just put that on there. No, no, that's right. You gotta do that. Now, there we go. Egg hat. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I'm, I'm an Eggman. Maybe Dr. Eggman. Okay. Um, let's see. That, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's the funny tale. <laughs> eh. Okay, actually, let's hold the club. There we go. Yes. Chocolate bar, egg hat, and the tail. <laughs> okay, let's see here. No, I want to get out of K mode because it kind of can mess with me. Okay, so this is what? We'll override all their skins acting as a full body costume. So, should always be set on torso armor. Okay. Well, let's do that. Okay. Now, I look like a freak of nature. Yeah. Okay. Well, I've got a tail. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, yeah, I'm running in a bunny outfit. Hello, Overraptor. Can I beat you with this, this chocolate bar? It's a level 45, and yeah, it ran. Okay. I would knock an Overraptor out with a club, but um, yeah, it would probably run away from me faster than what I can handle that. Okay, now, let's see here. Ah, Dillo. Uh, what level is this Dillo? This is a different green Dillo. 65. Okay, head over here. Um, I would let the trike attack it. Thought I saw a nice blue one over here somewhere. Will it attack the trike? Nope, it won't. Maybe it wasn't a blue one. Maybe that was a green one, though. It was that one. Who knows? Oh, he lost interest. Okay. Now... Um, let's see. I, I would like to find a dodo to whack with this club. Yeah, I think that's the dillo I saw earlier, probably. I thought it was blue, but it must be green. Now I need to... Yeah, I want to knock out a dodo or something or... Something. With a club. Because I want to knock something out with a chocolate bar. Parasaur? I could make a bola. And what level is this parasaur? Actually, I think there's a nice, what, colored parasaur over there? What level are you, dude? 20. No, I don't want a 20. Um, did that go in my suit? Overraptor, I wasn't even near you, dude. 
Okay, more dodo eggs. Yeah, we're gonna need a whole bunch of them. Of course, the tail wiggles as I run, too. Um, let's see. Right, there we go. I had seen a parasaur over here. That, I swear I saw a dodo fade in, in and out of existence there. Now, you, yeah, that's one thing you could do is you could run along the beach and just pick up the, do, the eggs as the dodos lay them and just, you know, keep running along and come back to the areas. What level are you? 25, okay. Yeah, you can just do... <laughs> well, here's a nice yellow and green and a different parasaur here that's kind of got a blue head. 150! Okay, uh, I'm interested in that. Um, let's see. I could try to tame that, but I need to make a bola. Um, let's... Can I make a bola? What does it take to make a bola? I need fiber hide stone thatch. Only three hide. I'd have to make a few bolas. Because, yeah, it will probably... Not just take one to knock it out with a club. Okay, let's get over here. One thing to note, though, is that um, these bunny dodos you can't tame. Uh, yeah, if you didn't know that already, because, yeah, you can't tame them. So, yeah, I'm gonna make some bolas here. And go clubbing on a parasaur. Because, why not? Okay, so, let's see here. We have some hide. I think it's fiber hide. What did I say it was? Fiber, hide, stone, and thatch. Okay, stone, thatch. Okay, so let's make um, 10 of them, I guess. Yeah, because why not? Oh, you know, I should do the bunny dance because it, it's just funny <laughs> as a bunny. But I gotta wait till I'm done crafting these because, yeah. Just got six more. I mean... Let's see. I'm out here. Uh, play emote. Excellent adventure. Let's do the bunny hop. <laughs> uh. Okay, the, yeah, that's funny. Okay, let's do the other other one. The wiggle tail. Okay, so you have to be behind yourself to look at that. Let's do that again. <laughs> yeah, that's just a weird emote. <laughs> it is funny, though. Uh, let's see the bunny hop dance from behind, because... <laughs> Uh, yeah, that, that's funny. Okay. I did not whistle him. Yeah, you can stay. Okay. Now, let's put this stuff back in here. 20 bolas should be enough. Or no, 10 bolas should be enough. Wait, no. Wrong area. Hmm. Well, I'll, I'll have to keep those there. Because, yeah, club. Oh, I do need stuff to repair my club, though. It's going to break. So, it takes fiber and wood. So, fiber and wood. I shouldn't have to repair it that many times. You never know, though. And I'll put this in there. There we go. Okay. Parasaur, here I come. What time is it? Getting night. Okay. And it's foggy. Now, I know Trison had said he saw a carn up on the cliff edge up there. So, that's going to be a kind of a problem. Hopefully, it doesn't fall down and attack said parasaur. Let's see. Are you the parasaur? 
You are not the Parasaur. Are you the Parasaur? You are the Parasaur. Okay. So, the way to do this is probably Bola this way. So, let's see. Um, that's the 25. This is the 150. So, if I Bola... There we go. Use the... Come on. Let's see how long it takes to club a Parasaur. Okay, finally took it down. Actually, it didn't take too, le too much longer. <laughs> um, I think one of us probably hit it after it went down, so yeah, it's not going to be a perfect tame. But it's not going to be perfect tame anyway because we have to tame it with Mejos. Uh, hopefully, there won't be any Dillos that come and attack it on us. I mean, yeah, this is a dangerous Dillo area. There's an Overraptor, so Overraptor should be fine. I'm going to grab some Mejos. And it is getting night, but we'll see how long it takes to tame it. I can always Gamma up as well if need be, because, yeah, darkness in Ark is dark. Why am I gathering so much? Who knows? Let's see. Eh, nope, eh, eh. Okay. So, Trizen's got a bunch of Medros on it. I'll throw the rest of mine on it. Throw some narcotics on and uh, narco berries on it as well. So, it's going to take a little bit. Yeah, 96.7%. It took a couple hits. But, oh well. It's not that big of a deal anyway because, yeah, Medros. Okay, gather some Dodo eggs while I'm here. And I guess, yeah, this is going to take a bit. So, bring it back when, it's, when it gets up. Okay, uh, yeah, the Parasaur is fully tamed now. Uh, it was actually fully tamed during the night, so yeah, I just waited till morning because night is not friendly with videos in ARC. So, um, 221, you know, not perfect, but it's not too bad. But, um, let's see. I thought I made one of these Dino Chickats, so I... I'm gonna put it on. Oh, you know what? I think we have to have a saddle first, so maybe I'll make a saddle quick. Um, actually, what does it take to make a saddle for a Parasaur? Parasaur shadows actually shouldn't be too bad because then we'll have, I mean, we'll have a berry gatherer, but you know, 
we don't need it that much either. Okay, 50 fiber, 80 hide, and 15 wood. Okay, so I'll, yeah, I'll have it follow me back. And there's an Ichthyornis over here that is uh, griefing us. Yeah, over there. So, yeah, and, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of this because, yeah, I don't need that in here. Untrack all, there we go. Okay, and I want to make sure I don't attack that trike because that will be the end of our parasaur if I do that. Okay, get over here. You following me? Okay. Now, where's that Ichthyornis? Did it, is it going to leave our base alone? Yeah, it was attacking our thatch roof. Like, you know, who wants to have a Paris and Ichthyornis attach their thatch? Uh, uh, attach. Attack their th the thatch roof. Can't even talk. Okay, let's see. Get myself some. Uh, was it fiber hide? I didn't even learn the Ingram. It was right here. Fiber hide and wood. Okay. Fiber. Uh, wood. And the hide. Okay, just make one. That actually took a, quite a bit of hide, so we need to refill our hide stores. Okay, there we go. Now, we have a nice mount to ride on. And... It has a weird chick hat that doesn't fit right. So, it, yeah, it goes over its eyes um, and maybe cuts off into its nose a little bit. Yep. But, uh, yeah, hey, <laughs> he looks a little funny. Uh, she. Uh, it's a she. Okay, so, uh, it's inter interesting, though. It's kind of fun. <laughs> now, um, one other thing I wanted to do was um, these eggs... Not only can you use them to uh, create the skins, but you can also open them for chibis and I think uh, the dino candy that change your an your dino's colors. So, placed bunny egg in area. Oh yeah, that's right. You place them and then you open them. Yeah. So place a bunch of them. I forgot about that. And then I think you can I think you can also paint them, but I, I don't have a paintbrush. So yeah, what you do is you just place them around. And then I think you can crack them open. Let me crack one open. Yep, Chibi, dire bear. Okay. Interesting. Chibi featherlight. Hey, I want to see the Chibi Featherlight. Ella, I'm interested in that. Sometimes you get nothing. Yeah. Lots of times you get nothing. But, um, yeah, hey, I'm interested in the Chibi Featherlight. I want to see that. Cancel that. Eh, nope. Okay, there we go. Eh, for some reason it didn't. Okay, yeah, that, I like the Chibi Featherlight. It looks cool. And it's got little blue-tipped uh, feathers as well <laughs> on the head. Uh, that, that's nice. I like that. Okay, let's try the dire bear. Yeah, cancel that. Yeah, he's a, a little bear cub. Yeah. <laughs> kind of cute. Uh, but I like the feather light better. So I will keep the feather light on me for now. As long as I don't lose it. And try to place more of these. Out of, when not in K mode. So let's just see. Just place a whole bunch of them around here crack them open. Yeah, you got to do this for each and every one of them, so it can be a little bit of a tedious process to crack them all open, but sometimes it's worth it for the chibis. They did add some new chibis with uh, this. What? Okay, G chibi glowtail, chibi gallimimus, okay, chibi stego, Chibi Aloe. Okay. So 
So I've got some other interesting ones. Why is my feather light just staying there? Isn't it supposed to... Oh, there, finally. It's It's got a really long follow distance. Huh, interesting. Okay. Um, now the aloe. The glow tail. I'd like to see that. <laughs> he looks kind of cute. <laughs> He's got those big eyes and... <laughs> and big head but <laughs> but I still kind of like the feather light better my preference Trizen's going to open some too let's check out just a couple more here the Gallimimus he's kind of funny looking <laughs> and I'll check out the Stego He looks very stern. <laughs> and then I'll check out the aloe quick. I think I've seen the aloe before though. Trizen had one I think in a previous, in our, one of our other servers. Yeah. I think he had, actually I think Trizen had this on uh, Crystal Isles recently. But this is an interesting white one. The, the chibis also can be uh, colored as well. So it's pretty interesting and nice. I still like the feather light though. So, um, yeah, I guess that's probably it for this video on the excellent adventure. It's a nice, I guess, uh, yeah, it's a nice event because, in my opinion, it's probably the easiest to get chibis from this event, I, get, I think. Because, well, maybe kind of in between this and the Christmas event, chibis come pretty easily during the Christmas event too because of Santa Raptor so or Raptor Claws I should say but uh, yeah it's actually not too hard to get them in this one because all you have to do is just collect a bunch of eggs and you can get hundreds of eggs from just following the dodos around especially if you find a whole group of them together like we found kind of over there by the hill side or ridge or whatever that is over there but um, yeah otherwise it's a it's a fun event and you can get some nice chibis from it fairly quickly by just cracking them open and then um the colored candies actually it looks like you i don't know if you can get them from the cracking of the eggs or not but you can get the colored candies from the santa over raptor no, not santa over raptors the bunny over raptors so yeah, they just kind of drop them at, just like the dodos drop the, the bunny eggs. So that's something to look for. I, there isn't any uh, bunny over raptors around here, and I'm being griefed by a parasaur. I, I tell you, parasaurs these days, they're, they're very rude. Okay, and I'm going to get to a way where I'm not faced towards the sun. Or I'm faced away from the sun. Uh, no, I'm faced towards the sun. There. And Trizen's in here with a feather light butt in the, in the wind, in the yeah screen <laughs> so um yeah that's it for this episode if you like this episode hit that like button we really appreciate it it really helps us out a lot if you haven't already subscribe hit that bell icon leave a comment and of course share it and of course come and join the nilusion discord because yeah it's a fun place to just hang out and chat and you know watch some streams and maybe stream yourself sometimes and you know find out about uh we got there's a i've been doing a list of free games that I find hanging around the internet sometimes. So yeah, that, you might want to check that out too if you come in. But uh, otherwise, yeah. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time with the smoke in the background. Yeah, uh, actually, let me, let me dance too. Because yeah, who doesn't like to do the bunny hop dance? We're all bunny hopping <laughs> and wiggling our tails, yeah. <laughs> oh, and also... I hope everyone has a happy Easter as well. <laughs>